Tight market means big opportunities. Let's face it, fewer houses mean higher prices. It's a classic case of supply and demand. We'll see this play out in markets with strong economies where many people want to buy. To decide where to buy, let's compare Bay Area with a couple of hot locations. Let's look at something called housing permits. These tell us how much new construction is happening, which impacts future supply. In the Bay Area, new single-family home permits were at a very low level and dropped in 2024 compared to 2023. Now, contrast that with hot markets like Austin and Phoenix. They've seen a jump in permits from a much higher level of 8 to 12 times. Trends indicate a big and growing housing supply. Another way to gauge availability is active listings, houses currently for sale. Pre-pandemic, the Bay Area already had a lower inventory compared to Austin and Phoenix. During the pandemic, inventory shrank in all cities. However, now Austin and Phoenix have 8 to 12 times more houses for sale and more to come. So, what does this mean for you? Keeping an eye on housing permits and active listings can be a smart move. Buying in a market with limited supply, like the Bay Area, can be a good investment in the long run, but be prepared for higher initial costs. Knowledge is power. Partner with a great real estate agent who understands your market. Good luck on your house hunting journey.